I barely turn a profit even in the best of times, especially since I usually hand out what I can to those in need. Would you care for some fruit? Better enjoy it before someone runs off with the rest of it. Has someone been stealing from you? Yes, almost every night. Not enough to force me to close shop, but definitely enough to hurt. Have you found any sign of the thief? Just a couple of old rinds near the storehouse. Not much to go on. Why haven't the guards looked into it? The guards blame the wildlife, but I doubt they believe it. I guess they have more to worry about than a woman and her livelihood. Is there anyone you suspect? I've known most people here since childhood. None of them strike me as a food thief. You want to talk about other vices, however? I know how to track. I could look for the thief. Really? Thank you. You could start in my storehouse by the river. Someone must be desperate to steal rather than just ask me. I'll see what I can find. Durval stormed the palace, and still he lives. Fine goods for a fair You'll price. regret not stopping when you're in the thick of... Hard every day. Sleep like a rock every night. This barrel's been moved recently. There we go. Tracks. Must have climbed up.
Maybe my focus will see something. You savage! You saved me from the sun's judgment. I did what now? I left the misery of Sunfall not long ago, knowing that I'd never be welcome back in Meridian. So, I've been stealing food from a woman at Bright Market just to survive. But the Glint Hawks must be the judgment of the sun. You believe it attacked you because you were stealing? Why else? What if I beg forgiveness from the lady? Will that absolve me and save me from the Glinthawks? I took care of the Glinthawks, but yes, you should return and apologize. The woman you stole from is kind. She'll forgive you. The sun has spoken! Thank you again, Savage. May the sun light your way! <sighs> Great. People finally stopped calling me outcast and I would 